You've just started your first Hypixel Skyblock Island. You craft basic essentials such as wood planks, a crafting table, sticks, and a pickaxe. And your next objective is to talk to Jerry. So you build a bridge, Jerry gets sentimental because he's been trapped on this island his entire life and he desperately needs you to help him. But you don't, and you enter this new world, which is very confusing and, and special. And you never go back to your island again. The first items you want are the Rogue Sword, the Undead Sword, Full Gold Armor, and the Lazy Miner's Pickaxe. The Rogue Sword is obtained by talking to Jamie at spawn. He explains how mana works, and then he gives you the Rogue Sword. Although not the greatest weapon, the Rogue Sword is extremely useful for movement speed. Every time you right click with the sword in hand, you gain a speed boost of plus 20 for 30 seconds, costing only 50 mana. The ability stacks, which means if you right click again, it gives a speed boost of plus 40 for 30 seconds, costing 50 extra mana. The Undead Sword is a powerful weapon with a base damage of 30, dealing 100% damage to most undead mobs. Since you're poor, you need to obtain some quick, easy money. By mining in the coal mines for a bit, obtaining the 100 coins required is a breeze. After walking through the coal mine, you will come across the gold mine. Gold armor is bought from the gold forager outside of the gold mine. I just said gold a lot in that sentence. The entire armor set costs 49 gold because Hypixel wanted nobody to buy this set of armor. But here we are. Diamond armor is better and still is dirt cheap. But this is just what I did. The final item you need is the Lazy Miner's Pickaxe. In order to obtain this item, you need to talk to a Lazy Miner, venture through the mines without him, find the pickaxe that he lost and don't return it, use it until you reach mining level 5, warp to the deep caverns, and never give the pickaxe back. Now that you have the 7 starters essentials, it is now time to start. Enter the deep caverns and make your way through the caves until you discover the emerald mine. Collect 250 emeralds so that you can unlock the magnetic talisman. The magnetic talisman multiplies your pickup range by 3 times. When the magnetic talisman is in your inventory, your pickup range is far greater than when it's not in your inventory. This is extremely useful when you're mining and fighting mobs. Enchanting your pick with telekinesis is also very efficient, but the magnetic talisman is still extremely useful. The second item you need is an enchanted diamond pickaxe. Travel a bit deeper and get to the obsidian sanctuary. Use a diamond pickaxe to mine 4 obsidian, obtain 5 diamonds, and buy 109 books from the librarian. Then, go to your island, craft an enchantment table and 36 bookcases, arrange them like so, and enchant your diamond pickaxe with a level 64 enchant. The lapis armor is obtained from farming, trading, or buying from the auction house. Once the armor set is obtained, enchant each piece at your enchantment table and reforge them at the blacksmith, which is near the coal mines. Keep reforging until you get either the wise or smart modifiers on each piece. And now it's time for... Travel to the diamond reserve and collect 10, wait, does that say 10,000? Oh, um, let me take a breather real quick. All right, uh, after collecting 10,000 diamonds in the diamond reserve and trying not to die, make 26 enchanted diamonds to craft hardened diamond armor. Enchant with as many enchantments as you can and then, wait, wait a second, there's a new armor in Skyblock? Son of a-